The Hawkesbury River is a great system to fish because there's so many species on offer and the best place to shop for all your tackle is right here at Big W. We've got great brands like Berkeley Gulp, you've got Shimano with their squidgies, you've got a whole heap of hard bodies from Halco which are one of the top Aussie brands and Reedy's, they'll catch you all sorts of kingfish. Come through here, miles of mustard hooks. On this side, loads of rods, plenty of escape with ET rod and reel combos, tackle boxes, it's all there. The Hawkesbury River's on the central coast north of Sydney and a great launching spot is the town of Brooklyn. It's less than an hour's drive from Sydney on the Pacific Highway and I'm doing it easy in the Toyota Land Cruiser 200. The LC200 is the king of the road when you're travelling throughout Australia like I am each week. The feature list is massive with vehicle stability control, downhill assist control, hill start assist control, active traction control, just a handful of the mind blowing technologies in this amazing vehicle. We've had to use it throughout the series but today it's just an easy cruise up the coast. The Hawkesbury holds all sorts of species but one of the main attractions is Mulloway or Jewfish. So my old mate Greg Joyce from 1300 Big Fish Charters is taking us to his favourite Mulloway hangout. He's brought along his son Jed, who's an old hand in the Hawkesbury. Greg's using Patnoster rigs with fresh squid. And we soon tempt a predator from the depths. Know your style mate. That's it, lift and wind. You see something? Oh, a little flabby. Now Jed's caught plenty of Mulloway, but believe it or not, he's never landed a flathead. So this little fella's his first. He's a nice little fish, very good. And your first flathead, it's even better. Within minutes, Jed's on again, and it's got a bit more weight to it. Lift him up, oh, will he shake himself off? No. <laughs> there you go, Taylor. Flathead and a tailor, it's not too bad. How's your arms? Oh, bad. Bad? bad. Taylor are tough fighting predators that can devour big schools of bait fish. Yeah, but a real good sport fish. You see those little teeth in there? Whoa, they are super sharp. But a beautiful little fish. Well done. Now, I love teaching kids about sustainability. So also on board today is Hans Juicet, a former commercial tuna fisherman who's invented an amazing system to protect some of our precious marine life. Every year thousands of seabirds and turtles die when they're accidentally hooked trying to eat baits thrown out by the longline tuna boats. So Hans came up with the smart hook system, a shield to cover the big tuna hook. But once that's attached to the hook, it covers the hook completely so nothing can get hooked on it. It adds weight to the hook so it takes it down very, very quickly. And um, it's also large enough so that they can't get it in their mouth and swallow it. The tricky part was getting the shield to fall off so the baited hook could still catch tuna. So Hans worked with researchers from Queensland University and QUT to create a pin made of a special alloy that reacts with salt water and dissolves when it hits the right depth. So once it hits the water it takes about you know 10 to 15 minutes before it actually dissolves and then the hood falls away. The birds, well, they're long gone and the bait's ready to catch some fish. That's the way it works. Testing has shown that turtles and seabirds don't get hooked up with the smart hook system in place. And with over two billion longline hooks set around the world every year, it's a simple Aussie solution to a huge global problem. Meanwhile, our young mate Jed has finally jagged a dewy. Oh, hang on a minute. It's got a bit more kick in it. Oh! I think every trip we've caught a Quite a Jewfish, he's not a big one, but the young bloke's done well. Mulloway can grow to more than 40 kilos here in the Hawkesbury, and this young fellow is a sign of a healthy system. The sustainable fishing, that's what it's been all about today, being able to get out there and look at those smart hooks and go fishing with Jed. Well, don't get much better than that.